As John Hammond realized his vision for Jurassic Park, his competitors began to see the potential of InGen's work. One of their main rivals, Biosyn, looked to close the gap by stealing the advantages that InGen and Dr. Wu had worked so hard to gain. To do this, they would need someone on the inside. So they enlisted a disgruntled computer engineer named Dennis Nedry. A plan was devised to steal InGen's dinosaur embryos with an inconspicuous canister created to house the precious commodity. Nobody really knows what happened that fateful night. What is certain is that Dennis Nedry and the samples were never seen again. Biosyn had failed. Unfortunately, so too had Hammond's dream. Decades later, businessman Simon Mizrani tried again, this time succeeding in delivering Hammond's vision to the world. Tragically, things didn't go as planned. Biosyn was waiting for its time, and they found it in the aftermath of Jurassic World's downfall. Now, led by Lewis Dodgson, a new era was dawning. While we don't know what the future holds, History has a habit of repeating itself.